Hello ladies and gentlemen and welcome to episode 21 of Let's Play Space Engineers. So this episode is going to be more of a destruction episode, yes, because um, I can't play this much on the save anymore. It's a bit too leggy. That one asteroid, actually all the asteroids had a lot of performance impact. And also our, all our multiplayer friends are pretty much not really doing multiplayer anymore. They weren't really into it as much. Um, not saying they quit on us per se, but I would say most of them are just not uh, doing multiplayer uh, right now. And I was thinking of starting a new series. Um, I actually was thinking of taking a break, but you guys are demanding it nonstop. You guys are bastards asking for more space engineers. So I thought maybe we'd start fresh and um, we consider doing something more like uh, single player. Uh, maybe like four asteroids instead of like a dozen, so I don't lag as much. And uh, disabling the transport ships. I don't know why, but I don't like them as much. I prefer re re getting my own resources because when we do the transport ships, and a lot of people are like, oh man, you should just take the entire ship. And I just, I can't play that way myself. I'm a person who likes to grind and work his way there. But now that we have all these features to automate the game and whatnot, I thought, eh, why not, right? I mean, how long would it actually take me to get this much power and wealth again anyways? Three episodes, four episodes? I mean, at least you guys would get more episodes out of it. Um, plus, it would be a new series and we'd have a better direction. I'd say we try some more automation, try some of the newer features, try making a little racing platform, things like that. The only downside to my entire Let's Play that I wish I could change, and maybe there is a way out there, is I would like to be able to increase my welding speed. That is my only, only thing I wish I could do. Um, just because, you know, with my time, you know, being busy guy, uh, for some of you guys who don't know, I'm making a game with a good friend of mine. Uh, we moved in, like, I don't know, half a year ago together, and we've been working on uh, an RPG, side-scroller, I've, I've told some people about this. It's not like a secret. And um, let's see if this does any damage to it. And it's going to be a side scroller, like, you know, the Terraria Starbound type style. And f after that, um, you can get into space over time. You like, you, you work the tech trees and stuff, and you get into space. And then it's a top down 2D space game. And you can explore the stars and go to other planets and have little space battles and it's like that kind of adorable little cute little featured uh, idea and uh, so this is the thing I work on on the, the side here so like you know plus I, um, I'm really big into games and I'm really big into MMOs uh, you might have seen I was playing a bit of World of Warcraft here and there and then I played some Final Fantasy I, I did take down the episodes they're unlisted I decided not to keep going with those series only because I cannot keep them stable plus there's a lot coming in my life in uh, as an MMO in the future. Uh, I might as well just tell you guys right away. Uh, there's a game called um, Wildstar that I'm really going to be interested in the near future. So um, it's a more like why waste my time, right? Oh yeah. Wonder how much damage that ended up doing. Oh, we have this base here still. Uh, so yeah, um, so I just wanted to hear your thoughts, your opinions. Um, as you guys know, I like the sandbox style of playing, and I like doing mining. I like you know grinding. I like starting from scratch in that sense. Um, I, I want to disable the ability to, um, you know, capture ships or have them even spawn. They're kind of annoying, especially since two of them are still on my screen. Um, but also, I'd like to find a way, if it's possible, to increase welding speed. It would make my Let's Play a lot better for you guys, I think, because then I can spend more time building and doing unique things rather than spending it all welding. So, we really didn't do that much damage. And this was from an asteroid. It actually hit us, but it got somewhat deflected by our our laser or our turret. Um, so yeah, I want to hear what you guys think. It's, if anyone's ever even heard of an ability to modify the welding speed, let me know, because I'll do that. Um, so I think I'm going to bring this episode to a closing. I know this is a pretty quick episode. 
I did just destroy my only ship to go around and destroy things with. Um, but yeah, uh, I guess this will put a closing to, was it Season 2? Did I call this Season 2? And well, I guess we'll start Season 3 in the near future. Um, but your impact, your impact, your uh, input would put a big impact uh, into the game. Also, if you know other space games that I can try or give a shot, let me know. Um, I was playing uh, Master Space there, which is a really fun little game. It's a bit quick right now. You just you go through the tech trees really fast, and there isn't a ton of things to do yet. Uh, it's got some PvP mechanics, but uh, my usual testers are busy. Uh, like I said, I want to do the Space Engineers as a solo uh, one this time, not multiplayer. Biggest reason is because I can get more done, and I don't have to depend on others as well. Because, you know, if they never show up, then I don't want to go on and, and, you know, that kind of style. Um, but, yeah, if you guys ever want me to play any other space games, like Kerbal Space Program, I wouldn't mind taking a break and playing other games as well. Let me know. Um, just let me know of some other space games that might be cool or worthwhile checking out. I'm really into space-like games, especially if they're related to, like, the sandboxy Minecraft slash Space Engineers... Even Star Maid. Star Maid isn't quite there yet for me because of how derpy it is to the progression-wise. But, uh, yeah, if you have any suggestions or ideas for this series or another series, let me know. Um, at the end of the month, we'll be doing a lot, and I mean a lot, of Wildstar. I'll probably be doing some this weekend. In the next day or two, you'll probably start seeing some Wildstar beta videos coming up. Uh, so, yeah, keep that in mind, and oh my... And, uh, yeah, thank you so much for watching. Hope you enjoyed this. And please don't forget to subscribe and leave a comment. And, oh, my goodness, we're under attack. Look at that. Just one shot at one of my refineries. Ha! And that's the ore falling out. That's badass. Holy crap. They're just... That was just... So it was probably just a tiny meteor, too. It wasn't, like, anything big or special. It was just this little meteor that hit. Huh. Didn't even have like a comment tail to it. Anyways, guys, thanks so much for watching. Don't forget to subscribe. See you next time.